Hey guys and girls, it's Panabomb and we are back with another indie horror on Itch.io. Tonight we are playing HG? Actually, I should check that. It just, it, the, the, the game name was just HG. Son of a gun. Let me, give me a couple of seconds here. Give me a second. I need to figure out what this is called. Yeah, HG. It's called HG. Um, it's, it's a haunted PS1 game jam game, I think. Because it, it, I mean, it says it right there, haunted PS1. Uh, but as you can see, PSX graphics. Uh, that's all I know. So let's just jump straight in and check it out. Stuttle. Stuttle. Oh, look at that. Look. This, this reminds me of, I'm going to go backwards. Oh, hang on. Whoa. Hey, whoa, whoa. What the heck? Wait, I could have sworn. Oh, the, the, the thing distorts in front of me. Oh, this is weird. So, uh, just to give you some context, when I'm moving, normally when you move, when you lift your finger, you expect them to stop. So, for example, my hand's here, and it, it just continues to move. Very weird. I don't know if I like that mechanism. What? Oh, it's, it's the, the mouse is super sensitive. So I'm, I'm really, like, being nitpicky right now. I'm sorry. But I play enough of these... Oh! Oh, sorry. I play enough of these games to kind of give some constructive criticism what the hell did it get darker here it definitely did okay good nothing happens oh overturned plant can i put it back in place i can't i can oh i can walk on top of it oh i'm very tall now after i walked on top of it i i definitely feel taller than normal like my head is basically scraping the lights look at that do i get restarted oh look at that i'm back on normal height now I'm gonna make myself taller again, just just because. Oh, I can't! Dang it! Ooh, look at that! Is that a plant? Oh, that! Oh! Wow! How did that scare me? What? Oh no, bro! Open the door. Nope. Okay. The 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 game is really really quiet. So that means um, any sound. Oh. Oh, Ugh. I'm scared. I'm just gonna go. I'm gonna leave that door. You guys can check it out. Tell me what you find. Okay, this is d d progressively darker and more decrepit. Um. Uh. Whoa, where? Here? Okay, there's a murder in that room. Uh, but I'm gonna leave. I think that's all I can do. There's there's barely any gameplay. It just keep going. Just keep going. Just keep going. Just keep swimming. Mm -hmm. Can I do anything? No, I just I just have to ignore it. Like nothing happened. Imagine hearing that though. Like just say you you live in one of these apartments. Um one of these doors. Oh, everything's really really distorted. Oh! Hi there. How can I help you? I kind of need to get to that lift. What if I go backwards? Would it be worse? What if I go back? Uh, okay, face my demons. Oh. Hello? Oh, okay, okay. Uh. Let's go. Oh, can I go backwards? I cannot. Can I fall off? Okay, I can't either. So I must... Oh, I can run. I should have probably done that from day one. Let's get whatever is at the end of the tunnel. Like a moth flying towards a light. We must venture forward. Onwards and upwards. Not backwards. Not sideways. Just forwards. Oh, it's a dead person. Ah! Teabag him. Teabag! What do I do? Oh. Okay, um, I don't know. I kind of wanted more. Like, how would I explain it? I feel like there could be a bit more storytelling. So the loop mechanism works because every loop means there's time passage or time has passed. And in this case, I think the time went backwards because when at the start, it wasn't as decrepit, the, 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 the door was boarded up. And then as it went, the door became not boarded up. And obviously, uh, the, the nasty things that has happened inside that room 
um, has come to pass. And and obviously the killer, perhaps you're the killer, or maybe you're the victim, I don't know, uh, basically escaped that room and presented itself just here, I'm here, I'm from the lift. Then you enter the lift and obviously then you see the dead body. The dead body could be you or you could be the killer and the, that was the person that you killed. I don't know. So I guess that's the whole story, but it feels like there could be a little bit more context to it. Um, or at least the ending could give me something more to grab onto in, instead of an end screen. But that's obviously it's a game jam game. The guy probably had two days, 48 hours, 24 hours, whatever it is to finish this. So it is very admirable what has been done. But I just wish there was more. Maybe this is a good thing that I wish there was more. Like more, more storytelling, more anything. So that I can kind of bite into it and then eat it. Oh, I love to eat it. Oh. But anyways, if you guys want to check it out, I'll leave the link down below. If you like the video, oh, this is really high up, isn't it? If you like the video, please smash the like button. If you dislike the video, please Take to this like one. Leave a comment, tell me what you think and tell me what the developers can do to make um, or maybe extend the story on what you think you was lacking from it. And let me know what type of games I should play next. Maybe I should play less horror games. I don't know, whatever you guys wanna watch, you know, let me know. But otherwise, you should keep smiling and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.